<laughs> now, I was sharing with you my new book, Parents Adrift, which will be coming out soon, but you've just released your new book, yes. um, Pick Three. Pick Three, yes, Pick about three. finding work-life balance. Yes. Or I, really saying that you can have it all, just not every day. <laughs> Absolutely. So does it work for you? So in the morning, do you think about your three or is it something you have planned for the night before? Or do you look at your whole week and think, these are the only three I'm going to be able to pick this week? Yeah, I, for me, I, it's at night before I go to bed. So right. I, I kind of pick it. I, I reevaluate what I picked. And uh, so the five categories that I choose from in my life are work, sleep, family, friends, fitness, pick three. Awesome. And uh, so every day you get to pick three of those and the next day it's different. And so at night before I go to bed, I take two minutes to just write in the, in the notes app of my phone, yeah. which three I chose that day, and which three I want to choose the next day. And, you know, sometimes life throws a wrench in those plans. A child gets sick or something mm. happens at work, or, you know, or you don't sleep well. And yeah. so you have to reevaluate. But it's... Um, it's always good to kind of go into the day prepared. But that's cool because that means if life does throw a spanner in the works, you've just picked another three. So you don't feel like your whole day's been messed up. That's exactly, you've still got three things That's done. exactly right. And, you know, we're here together today. That Today I'm, I'm picking work and, and I love it. And, and I don't feel guilty yeah. about it because I know when I go home, I'm going to pick family. Yeah. And I'm going to be all in with my children. Yeah. And so I, I don't have that guilt that I think so many parents have of feeling like they have to be a perfect mom and great at their job every day. You you know, you can, it's okay to be a little lopsided. Yeah, then you don't feel <laughs> torn. I actually have a great theory I'd like to share with you. Yeah. And that is everyone talks about their morning routine. But I have a theory. We should actually flip it to their evening routine. Because yes. if we get the evening routine right, the next morning flows. Is Absolutely. I think you're spot on. And uh, I actually think about evening routine a lot. In fact, mm. I have an alarm to go to bed, just <laughs> so like I have so an alarm I. to wake up in the morning, <laughs> right? And I try really hard to put my phone down 30 minutes before I go to bed. Yes. Um, so I think there's a lot of things that you can do to, to set yourself up for success the next day. So I think that's great. I